Hi, I'm here to show you how easy it is to install the latest Acorn magnetic safety locks. In this short video, I'm going to demonstrate how to install these locks on both overlay cabinet doors and drawers, as well as the inset cabinets. Overlay cabinets are where the doors and drawers sit on the outside of the door frame, and inset cabinets are where the doors and drawers sit on the inside of the cabinet frame. I will explain more about the different types of cabinets and show examples of both in the installation sections of this video. I've got a 10 pack of locks here. In your Raycon box, you will have 10 locks, 10 catches, two magnetic keys. Now these will arrive attached to the key holders, so it is important that you remove the key from the key holder prior to use, as this will increase the strength of the magnet. Spare adhesive, so whilst the adhesive is super strong on the Acorn locks, spares are included just in case of any accidental damage. And most importantly, the applicator, which will help you with the installation. And for installation, you may need a pencil and a tape measure or ruler. So here's how your locks will work. The plastic catches are attached to the inside frame of your furniture and the plastic locks go on the back of your door or drawer. When you close your door or drawer, the hook on the lock hooks onto the catch plate to lock the cabinet shut. As you approach the lock with your magnetic key, it will unhook from the catch, allowing your cabinet door to open freely. It is very important that you click the hook forward to lock your locks before using them, as when they are unlocked, they will not hold the door closed and the magnetic key will not work. By default, the locks come in the unlocked setting in the packet. Before starting, it's important that you understand what kind of furniture you're installing your locks on, as this will impact how your locks are installed. So we will start with overlay furniture. This is when the drawer or door sits on the outside of the cabinet frame. So your Acorn locks can be installed in three different directions facing left, facing right, and facing up. And for stronger, thicker doors, we recommend facing up, which is what I'll show you now. Before installing the locks, be sure to clean and dry the installation area to prevent contaminating the adhesive. So pop your lock onto the applicator provided and remove the protective tape from the applicator. It's important to keep this safe so that you can reapply it when your installation is complete. Stick the applicator to the wall of your furniture, making sure it's flush to the edge, completely straight and not at an angle. This is super important as it ensures that the lock can hook onto the catch plate effectively. Remove the film from the back of the lock. Close the door fully. Reopen. And your lock is now stuck in the correct position. Firmly press down on the lock to improve connection but be careful not to move it. Draw two faint pencil mark lines parallel to the two small lines on the inside of the applicator. This will accurately allow you to align the catch to the lock. Remove the applicator and carefully replace the film lid onto the sticky tape. Gently remove the film from the back of the catch plate and firmly stick the catch plate on the furniture wall. It is vital that the catch plate lines up with the two pencil marks to ensure that the lock can hook onto the catch. If it doesn't align, the hook will not reach the catch and your furniture will not lock. Check that your lock is in the lock position to allow the key to move the lock. Close the door. Your cupboard's now locked and safe. When unlocking your locks, remember to remove the key from the holder before use to increase the strength of the magnet. Whilst the Acorn lock uses the strongest magnets on the market, they will only work through doors that are up to 38 millimeters or 1.5 inches thick. To unlock the locks, simply place the magnet key on the outside of your door, lining it up with the lock, the hook will be released and the cupboard door can now open. Your pack includes 
small padlock stickers that can be stuck onto the outside of your cupboard as a reminder of where the lock is. If you've experienced any problems with your door not locking, first check that you've clicked the hook forward to put the lock into locked mode. If you still have a problem, check if you have buffer beads or little stoppers on the frames of your cupboard. These may sometimes prevent the lock from reaching the catch plate and could prevent the furniture from locking. To solve this, carefully remove the catch plate and reset it manually so it sticks forward from the edge of the frame by the exact same distance as the thickness of the buffer bead or stopper. When you close your door, your locks should now lock. As the locks use a magnet, it's also important to not install them too close to metal fixtures or fittings like a hinge or screw, as these can interfere with the magnet efficiency. And that's how you install your Acorn magnetic safety locks on overlay cabinets. For inset cabinets and drawers, the installation is a little different. For this, you might need a pencil and a tape measure or ruler. I'm going to show you how to install it on a drawer, but the steps are identical when installing on a cabinet door. Inset cabinets are when the doors and drawers sit inside the frame. For this type of furniture, the catch plates need to be installed back from the edge of the furniture wall to allow for space for the doors to shut. To ensure these are installed at the right distance, simply measure the thickness of the door. This is exactly one centimetre and then measure the same distance back from the cabinet edge and mark this distance with a pencil. So once you have the depth of the door marked on the furniture wall, install them in the exact same way as we did for the overlay cabinets, making sure that you place the front edge of the applicator on the pencil mark. Always make sure that it is straight to allow for the lock to hook onto the catch. And Yep, that is exactly one centimetre. Remove the film from the back of the lock. Close the door fully and reopen. The lock is now stuck in the correct position. Again, firmly press down on the lock to improve connection. As we did with the overlay cabinets, draw two faint pencil mark lines along the edges of the applicator. This will allow you to accurately align the catches to the lock. Remove the applicator and carefully replace the film cover onto the sticky pad. Gently remove the film lid from the back of the catch plate and firmly stick the catch plate on the furniture wall, making sure it aligns with the two pencil marks and is installed set back to the same distance as the thickness of the door which in this case is exactly one centimetre. Again, make sure the catch plate is straight and not at an angle. And that's how you install your Acorn magnetic safety locks on inlay cabinets and drawers. Mm -hmm.